Let's just take one chord. Let's make it real simple. How about F? To just to change the key. F minor. Okay? Okay, let's say it's all... Okay, that's the pulse, right? And now he comes over and he says, solo. He says, uh-oh, what am I going to do? Okay, how about starting with an idea like... making a little motif, right? Let's try this. Now you say, now what am I going to do? I can't keep playing that over and over again, right? You say, okay, I'm sick of that. Right now, I'm in A. But at least I'm in A. I got a little melody. Now let's go to A1. We need to build something on that. Same motive, right? Sort of make it a little longer thing, the same rhythmic pulse. Everything is sort of moving along real nice. Now, but you can't stay there. Say, what am I going to do now? You set up one event where you said, first event, second event. At a certain point in time, your body or your audience or the band leader is going to let you know that's enough. And <laughs> usually the audience is going to say, okay, it's time to move on and you play something else. So then you, you got to hook up some kind of way of linking this with A3. Let's say we're going to continue that. How about this? A1. A2. I'm moving along right now. A3. Now what I've done is taken the same motif, da -da, dee -da -da, then I changed the melody a little bit, da -dee -da -da, and I intermixed them a little bit, and now all of a sudden the third event is I'm shortening the time span. I'm making it a little more agitated. So I feel like I want to, it'll push me in to the next phrase I'm going to start. Okay, so I'm going, that's A. Now I got to go into the second event. Now I need to go to the third event. Each time the rhythmic impulse is getting a little faster, and now it's at the right point in time. See, if you guys time this right, I mean, by the time you get to B, already your audience is talking about, whoa, because you've taken them from here to there, and you just didn't do it by playing A. Because if you play that, say, over a 16-bar period, you might tend to get a little bored, right? So we built up into B. Now we've got to B, right? Okay, we're in, the, in this pattern going to the da 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 Now what I'm going to do? you do well we're dealing with one chord now <laughs> now we can't we've had a so let's try something else we built up maybe we need to start over somewhere else so now I'm playing another melody right now I'm into another melody that's not the same as now I'm doing Still melodic, and now I'm in B. Now I need to develop that idea. Now, okay. How about a little? How about something else? 
something like that, just falling off the phrase. You know, this is just all off the top of my head now. I'm just thinking, okay? So we've got, now we've gotten to B1. We're almost through. Now, this, the problem with the thing so far, so far it was real nice and neat. But we haven't gone anywhere. Now, one little trick that gets them every time is that once you, you know, because repetition is the key to all of this. This really, really, really makes this stuff work. You, do, you sort of developed your, your A idea. You sort of developed your B idea. You and then you did a little fall off. Okay, now we need to go somewhere else. This thing needs to explode. Maybe we should do something rhythmic. You know what I'm saying? I mean, break the rhythm of, you've been playing legato a lot. Suppose we said we did uh, Okay, now we got C, the basic idea for C. Something like that. You see what I'm saying? Let's put all three of them together. Now, I haven't developed C yet, because let's leave that for the last. We don't know where we're going to go with this thing. But we got to come up with something that's going to make this thing explode at the end, right? So now, if I can remember all three of these sections, <laughs> let's see. Hmm. OK, the first one was, or something like this. Oh, yeah. Something to break it up, okay? What I decided to do is, let's really get crazy. Change the chords a little bit, it's all left. A little push beat on the end, helps me round it out, and I'm at D. I'm finished. <laughs> 